day three. So it's morning, it's Saturday morning. Yes, it's Saturday morning and it's 8 a.m. We're going to uh, start busing the first group out to the village. Um, Amber and her group will go around 9.30. Uh, but we're all gonna meet at the same village and uh, we're gonna get started on the dry latrine and some other things that Billy's got planned for us. Uh, however, uh, Amber and them, I'm not sure what they got going on. They're gonna be doing a lot of teaching stuff, so they're gonna plug in in a different in a different way out at the village. And so now we're on our way to the village Shapumba. I gotta tell you, the countryside is just beautiful. The further from the city we got, the more rural it was on the countryside. It was just absolutely breathtaking. Daniel is imagining that it's this way. <laughs> One hour later. I was just telling him the next crew, the, the next crew that he brings is going to be a lot more fun. Yeah. With Irma and her sister. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> help, help, help. Eventually. So we just had to get out and help him push to get up this hill. Yes. And uh, I think we're we're in good shape now. At least for this go round. We have one more hill. We had to get it up on, but we're good for now. Yeah. Uh, you know, we take for granted everybody's got jumper cables. And that thing almost didn't start, but it's good now. I mean, this country out here is so beautiful, so green, that even Javier, as you can see right there, was taking a picture of the landscape. Oh yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. Alright guys, we made it back in the van. Looks like you made it up the hill. I think everything's alright now. Yeah, this is a boom actually. Okay, that's Yeah, but I'm not, I'm not sure where is Daniel going. <laughs> okay, so we made it to Shapumba. Yeah, we are here in Shapumba. Alright. And over here. Oh, over here behind us is the, uh, it's kind of like the village square. I don't know if you can see that. I'm sure we'll get some more about it. Okay, this is a small town here in called Chapumba. It belongs to Tarapoto, the department of San Martin here in Peru. I hope we are going to spend time here with the people, making something special for them. And at the same time, sharing the gospel with children and people. Young people, old people, every, everybody. Everybody. Yeah. Everybody. What? All right. All right, we got all the wood offloaded for the dry latrine, and we're going to await our next instructions. So, this uh, piece of her is the church. One brother, he, do, he uh -huh. donated this place. Y esta parte todavía no han hablado si se le va a donar o lo va a vender. Okay, this part, this part is not talking about it to the owner, no. It's from the church or no, it's not, not sure about this donated to the church, but that place is donated just for the church, to be the church. Pero aquí va a ser el, la, el baño seco. So, but this is the place we are working, the dry bathroom. In the post. Dry latrine. Ah, dry latrine. El vecino dice va a tener envidia, porque de ellos así nomás. 
So the, the neighbor is going to be jealous because his bathroom is like that. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sí. What is this for? Lemon, yeah, like a lime. It looks like a lamb. Yeah, but we call we call cidra. Cidra. Cidra? Okay. It's got the word citrus in it. yeah, but it's it's acidic. It's like a lemon. It's like a lemon. Uno, uno, a, a cada uno, ¿no? A uno. Y, use, y cerrarlo con un candado. Y utilizar el espacio para que sea espacio más grande. Uh -huh. So, in the past, they've been divided into two separate rooms with separate entrances and all. But what they're thinking right now is they're going to build this in one room, but then they're going to place a box over the, over the uh, one that's not being used and lock it. And then they can switch off that way and have more space in the bathroom. Yeah. So, and this is, again, this is the first time that they actually have a real commode. Yeah. Before it's always been manufactured out of uh, PVC. So that picture you showed me, was that, that that's actually what they're going to use? Yes, yes, those are bought for this. I didn't know that. Okay, very good. I thought it was going to be a home. Mm -hmm. No, these are, these are actually the first ones that have a real nice. commode. So, and a commode is called an inodoro. Inodoro. Yeah. Okay, so so the measurement is one one meter ninety centimeters by one by one uh, meter. I don't high. see any tape measures. Mm -hmm. Yep. They've got eyes. Oh yeah. For, for, this, for, for that side, it's gonna be the door. For this side. To entrance to the to the inner door. So what do we need to do? So can I stop this? Necesitan alguien que sepa subir cocos. They need uh, someone who needs to climb up the tree. <laughs> cocos tree. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I give you a boost. Yeah. yeah. So here we are busting up rocks and clearing a path from the front of the church around the side. There's a lot of tree stumps, a lot of rocks. They're sandstone, so they bust up pretty easy. But we're, we're needing to clear a path so it will be easy for everybody to walk back to the dry latrine. So no doubt some of these sandstones were easier to bust up than others, along with the tree roots. I'd have to say that was the hardest physical labor out of the whole deal. But once we got that pathway done, the build was pretty easy. So what we're doing here is we're taking a load of topsoil with the concrete mix and we're actually mixing it dry here on the roadbed in the middle of the road cars are and motorcycles are kind of just going around us here but yeah we mix it dry first then add water yeah one of the one of the children said uh, said uh, are the gringos coming <laughs> yes and are they going to take us <laughs> See? Uh, Oh, strong. Oh, yeah. At this point, everybody around us is pitching in to stack these bricks, including the kids. And I got to tell you, I had a lot of fun. I was chasing the kids back and forth, telling them they were strong. And uh, they're, they're really starting to warm up to me at this point. Oh, yeah. oh. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. So strong. I mean these kids at first. Oh yeah. They don't they rarely see white people 
in this more. village. So they were really more. unsure of what was going more. on. But they are okay. warming up to us now. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Okay. Oh, strong. Oh, look at raw. It's strong. It's strong. Practice, practice. Oh, strong. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so as we just seen, the kids were helping load everything. We got the cement mixed out front. We're either bringing it back in buckets or laying the foundation. Oh, oh, they're laying the foundation for the dry latrine, stacking the uh, the the uh, bricks. That's going to make the base. It's going to be about three feet high, I believe. And so, yeah, that's where we're at. Okay. Uh, no, this one. Water? Agua. That's good. That's cool. This is the This is the advertisement for coconut water here. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's good. That's good. Yes. See. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. Where to? Down the hill. Down hill. <laughs> okay. Oh, Workman's comp. Nah. <laughs> Hola. Niños, uh, eh, niños, eh. Eh, niños, eh. My niños. So the neighbors really oh. had nothing to do with the project. I don't think. I could be Listen. wrong. But you. They I were standoffish from us. See? See? And my my niño. <laughs> What's this, Randy? So I can just about guarantee you none of these kids have seen a drone. May not be a big deal to us, but over there they really, I really captivated their attention. And they kept talking about this pineapple field down the street. And I thought, man, this is a good opportunity to get this drone out there. And let's see some of the landscape that they tell us about.
Okay, we go. We go flying. Adios. Adios. You see? There's a village. Chapunda. Chapumba. Si. Si. Yeah. Igualito. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you see? You see? The chumbu. Chapumba. Chapumba. That's a knee. Bueno? Oh yeah. Okay, we'll bring it back. We'll bring it back, we're coming back. Mira, 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 dame. There it is. Oh yeah. Mira, mira. It's okay? Okay. <laughs> Maybe later we'll fly. You know, it's so cool because that's probably the first time they've ever seen their small village from a bird's eye view. And uh, there's more opportunity to get the drone out, but we're also there to do a job. So I really had to, I was struggling with Man, do I do this or do I do this? You know what I mean? <laughs> so I'm guessing it's time to get back to work. And you know, there's a lot of mortar that needs to be laid. We got to lay the foundation. The mortar has to be in between the bricks. And I got to tell you, I would have done anything for a hoe and a wheelbarrow. Two simple tools that we don't even think about. Uh, it's a no-brainer. We got all that stuff uh, over here, but uh, when you don't got it, man, it's it's uh, you have to get creative, and it's kind of tough at times. Oh, oh. So the plan is to put this as a, a flooring, but is there going to be any kind of piping? There'll be a little bit of piping, not much. So it'll go through the concrete? Uh, so, so you're going to have a block base. Okay. That's uh, three feet high. Okay. And then you'll have wood floor on top of that. Okay. okay. And everything goes down into that concrete base. Okay. And there is where it uh, decomposes. Decomposes. Okay. Do they get, um, do they have a special uh, enzyme for decomposing? Nope. nope. Just all natural. By now, you know, it, it's been going on for a while and my back is starting to really talk to me. And, but I'm not one to say anything, but uh, on the inside, the man, on the I was here. done with this. But I kept on pushing through. So I noticed there's no uh, gravel. Nope. It's mortar mix. It's mortar. Okay. So this, this uh, we'll be using bricks. Yeah. Okay. So if we're coming back out tomorrow, nobody's staying the night here. We won't be here tomorrow. Huh? We won't be oh. here tomorrow. Okay. And I know if I'm Gracias. getting pretty exhausted at this point, I know yeah, Billy I know. is wore out. Somebody's this got, dude pushes harder than anybody lean the shovel. I've ever seen. Yeah, you ready to load up? Okay. 
Oh. Let me give my uh, uh, coconut. I'll be right back. Oh, I use this in your Oh, no. Say it ain't so. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good coconut. Woo! It's a bueno. Mmm. Para la orina. Aquí en medio. So we're going to make hole here. No sé, no sé. No sé impaciente. Bailey also. There goes a pig. Oh, there's a pin down here at the bottom of the table. Oh, there you can see it. It's gone. It's gone now, you can see it. Yes. Lemon, yeah, and then there's the orange. Eight, 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 e